What's up guys, this is Killin' Dylan here with a video. Um, I've been gone for a while, but people have been wanting new videos, so I decided, well, I'll try and make one. This is just going to be an update on the mounts I've had since our last video. Uh, I have gotten the 100 mount achievement, here it is. I got that on July 1st, 2010, and that today is April 10th, 2012, so I've been gone a while since I got that. But let's just get started, and I'll show you where you can get all the mounts I've gotten since then. First, we're going to show you this. This is the Abyssal Seahorse. You get this one in Vajir. You can only use it there, so it's pretty pointless. You'll get it in a quest chain. As long as you do quests there, you should find it. Then I have the Black Drake mount. This one you do in 10 man Obsidian Sanctum, and you can easily 3 man it if you have 3 gear late, three geared level 85s. 4 man probably be easier, but. Three can work. After that, the blue dragon hawk. That's one. That one's from the hundred mount achievement. So when you get hundred mounts, you'll just see this thing in the mail. Then you have the camels, and the camels you get out here in Oldham. It's one of the new zones in Cataclysm. You get exalted with Romkahen, and you can get that. Um, let's see what else we got. Um, the flying machines. I picked up engineering I think the day I made that 97 mount video I think I got 100 mounts like the next day or something but you get these uh, if you're an engineer I think this one you make it like 300 or something uh, and then after that we have here we go the mountain horse this is the standard version of the mountain horse which I guess it doesn't, there's no standard and epic version anymore because it just goes to your speed anyway. You get this if you're exalted with Gilneas. So just grab a tabard and run some dungeons with them. You can get that pretty quickly. Then I have Red Proto Drake. Uh, this one, this one's pretty easy to get now. You just have to do the glory of the hero. That's all the achievements from the 80 dungeons, heroic. Just do all those ones right there and you'll get that one in the mail. Uh, after that, I have the red battle tank. You can't mount that here, but it's Encourage. This is a 1.39% chance drop off random mobs in Encourage. But if you just do the kill the three of those beginning mobs, reset it, run out, and just keep doing that, rinse and repeat, and you'll get that pretty quickly. I got that in like half an hour. This is the Spectral Griffin. You get this from Scroll of Resurrection. If you resurrect someone, they pay for 30 days game time. So. If you have a friend that doesn't play, send him one, you can get him out. Um, then I have. Did I miss one? Nope. Okay. Uh, the Lovebird. Swift Lovebird. Uh, you get this in, during Valentine's Day, or you can buy it on auction because it's buying on equip. I bought this for, I think, 9,200 gold, something like that. Um, so, yeah, it's not exactly cheap, but it's not too bad with how easy it is to get gold now. But yeah, or you can save up and get it during Valentine's Day. And then here's the other mounted horse. This is the swift one. This one is black. Still exalted with Gilneas and buy it. And then I have the Hawk Strider. This is another rare mount drop I got. Wow, so, I mean, that's three for me. So, you know, I'm coming up in the world now. Still haven't got the Death Charger at 200 runs, but that's fine. I'll get it soon. Uh, this one is from Magister's Terrace on the Isle of Kildanis on Heroic. I actually had a video of me getting this. It dropped, but my uh, game cam wasn't up to date, so the video got corrupted and I couldn't play it. But, you know, it is what it is. I got over it. Um, then there's another camel. This is the tan one. There's tan and brown. There also is a gray one, and that's if you find this mysterious figurine on the ground. You right-click it, and it has a chance to teleport you to this place in Feralis. You kill this guy, he drops a white camel, or a gray camel. Um, but then here's the turbocharged flying machine. This is the epic version of the flying machine. This one you make it, I want to say 400, 400, 350, something like that in engineering. So if you're an engineer, you can make that. The only hard part about that was Corium when I made it. I'm not sure how Corium is now to find. And then we have the Wing Guardian. This one you buy in the Blizzard store. It's a pretty cool looking mount. This is 25 bucks to you guys for all your characters. Uh, so yeah, and then the last one I've gotten since then is the Winter Spring Frost Saber. 
This used to be a terrible grind to get this mount, but uh, now it's not so bad. You just do a daily quest for 20 straight days up in winter spring and you'll get it. Also, I got the, my 100th mount was the Black War Seed, but I figure you guys know how to get that. I think it's stupid how easy it is to get this now. It's like 200 honor points or something like that. Um, so, yeah, that's that's it. That's all I've gotten since then. If you guys have any requests, some videos you want me to do, comment, rate, subscribe. I'll try and get more out. I know I've been lacking, but uh, I wasn't really playing. So, thanks, guys. Uh, just let me know what you want. Right now.